Hello, happy Sunday to everybody. What a blessed day. Got me a little Sunday lunch here. Me and my cornbread, we wasn't getting along today. So I got a little spaghetti, some greens, and a piece of fish, fried catfish. And for the drink, y'all, I got me some Coke Zero. Yes, 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 yes. Anyway, how's everybody doing? You know I got my Franks, y'all. Got to get my little Frank. And if I ain't putting Franks on everything today. Whew, but anyway. Heavenly Father, thank you for this food. Thank you for this day. Thank you for the food that I'm about to receive. For nourishment of body in Christ's name. Amen. Lord, please bless everyone out here that's viewing this video today and sharing in this meal. In your son Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Well, I hope everyone is having a wonderful and fantastic Sunday so far. Greens and cornbread, y'all. Mm, 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 mm. I woke up, you woke up, and if you're watching this, you most definitely are blessed. Mm. I was going to church this morning, but some kind of way, I just got sidetracked. I never did make it to service. So I was watching my one of my favorites, Joel. Mm. Oh, that is so good. It's been sitting on my plate in a minute, so this one got a little cold. But it's edible. Oh, yeah, I'm weak. I went ahead and bought some furniture, y'all. Wish they delivered it yesterday. I had some buyers with them once after I bought it. I always do that. Once I make a big purchase or something, I always regret it. I mean, I don't, you know, just be second-guessing myself. But after they delivered it, I felt okay about it. It's done now, so you know how that is. But does anybody else do that? You know, you you think about a purchase forever. You know you need it. Uh, you think about a purchase forever. Then when you finally do it, you be like, I don't know if I should have done that. Mm -hmm. Y'all was watching one of the, I watch a lot of YouTube videos, not just my things. But I was watching one of the ladies I'm subscribed to. And she was saying something about, you know, she support YouTubers, but they don't support her. And, you know, my thing is, when you get into this, I really start doing this because I really enjoy it. I enjoy it watching them and, oh, I started making them. I subscribe to people, and they don't subscribe to me, but it doesn't matter about that because you should watch people because you really love them and really enjoy their channel. Not because you're looking for them to necessarily subscribe back to you. And you shouldn't, excuse me, you do not support them if you really, you know, were genuine in why you started watching them anyway. Because they don't watch you. Because that's not what it's about. You know. Okay. My thing is this. The people that's going to watch you. Going to watch you. And support you. Going to support you. Not everybody going to like you. And sometimes you get people that come to your channel. And say support them. And it's not even something you're interested in watching. So. That's what you have to think about. And not be so bent out of shape about it. And. You know, remember why you started YouTube if it's something you really love. And enjoy, just keep doing it. So, what's my stance on that? You know. And I watch a lot of people. Lord forgive me, I don't necessarily subscribe to them. And I watch their videos every week. I don't know. 
I tell you, I done got hooked. And I, it's not even a 99 cent store here. I have gotten hooked. And I was watching Yekka's channel. It's how I got hooked on them. She did a 99 cent haul. And I was just so astonished at her 99 cent haul. So, I put it in the search engine and other people started coming up. So, I just start, started watching them. And I don't think I'm subscribed to any of their channels. I just watch the videos. Made me think when I go to Texas. In fact, I know I'm going to have to take my little happy tail in the 99 cent store. Just so I can see for myself. I, I'm not even a big shopper. But I'm just so impressed with the brands and stuff they have in the 99 cent store. Hmm. Wish they had one here. Do they have one where y'all live? I should have bought some more of this fish. Because it's good. You know, but I really didn't want that. I wanted some buffalo, but. And they didn't have any. So what y'all having for Sunday dinner today? A lunch or it's kind of early. You know, so. I got a cabbage in there. I need to cut up and cook. Mm, I'm going to do that a little later. Throw some okra over in the pot and have that for my lunch tomorrow. My daughter said she was coming over here. So, she wants some dinner. Yeah, just use me. Well, she should have been cooking for me. Um... I was watching a mukbang from Two Nappy the other day on the uh, air fryer. And I had been looking at, you know, the infomercials. And then they had a thing, well, Cooking with David. Sometimes he'll show it on QVC. And anyway, my daughter ordered one. And when she moved into her apartment, she put it up on her counter. But she hasn't used it yet. It's purple. It's big. And... Sorry. After I saw two nappy do those chicken wings, I think I want me one of those at first. Or I'm at least going over there to her house and try that one out to my daughter's apartment. Mm hmm. Do any of you have one of those fries? And so, how you like it? My daughter is so strange. So she got a purple one, right? And I was like, this don't match nothing in your kitchen. I, uh, it's just odd. I thought she would at least try to, you know, match her stuff up. But to each his own. It's, that's her house. I'm just so sad. I don't match it, match it. Anyway, y'all. Um, I end up getting some brown furniture, of course. It's like a taupey like color. Something neutral. I thought I was going to go for something different, but I ended up not doing so. Yeah, this was a good little lunch. Dinner, brunch, whatever it is. It's early, so I know it's noon. I know I'm going to eat again. Well, because this is my first meal of the day. That's a big lie. I had a sandwich earlier when as soon as I got up this morning I was starving. And I had a uh, some deli chicken breast in there. Rotisserie chicken breast and I ate a sandwich. I take that back. That was my breakfast. And then I didn't want nothing because I ate right away. Sometimes you waste wake up real hungry sometimes. I went in the store in the Exxon. And my little friend, they're selling their Exxon to someone else. So this was her last day. So I went up there specifically to see her. Um, she's Indian. And she had a, some different kind of yellow mango for me. Because I eat a lot of fruit. And she was she always talking to me about different fruits. 
And she had a yellow mango for me. So I'm going to... I got some mango I cut up yesterday. But I'm going to cut that one up. Damn. Mm. Oh, my God. I'm not smoking. Oh, darn it. I can't never eat without wasting something on myself. I need a bill. Oh, excuse me. Anyway, y'all, uh, I'm about to end this because I am done. Mm -hmm. And I ate it all and it was delicious. Oh, but anyway, thank y'all for stopping through. This was just a quick little bite here. And it was good. Excuse me for my fingers, y'all. Anyway, I want y'all to have a happy and blessed Sunday. Enjoy the rest of your day. Some of y'all might be working today. Have a good work day. I want y'all to have a good night's rest. And I thought I saw some money out there on the ground in the parking lot, but that's a leaf. Anyway, <laughs> y'all have a wonderful day. Know that I love you. God loves you the most. Remember to always be kind to yourself and others and be joyful and be blessed. And don't forget to share that beautiful smile. Plant it on your face. Walk in victory. Walk to your own beat today. Share your smile with someone to help uplift and encourage them today. And remember, have a blessed one. I'll talk to y'all later this week. Love you. Bye.